by now you would know that we can name individual cells and when we look at an individual cell we go up here to the left hand side you can see in the name box there it says d9 so that's the specific reference but i can actually go and name the cell something other than d9 so when i right click on that cell you can see i can say define name and i'm going to say mine and i'm going to click ok and you'll see when i click on the cell above it it's still got a normal cell reference but when i click on that one i've now got a name now in today's video we want to see can we actually name an entire range not just one particular cell well let's take this for argument's sake and we're going to use this and i'm going to highlight the entire range now where would i go to do that okay so all i'm going to do i'm going to do exactly the same thing i'm going to right click on it i'm going to go define name and then i'm going to say my range but just watch out because it doesn't always like spaces and i'm going to click ok now when i click anywhere else nothing when i click over here nothing but when i highlight that whole range you can see it changes to my range so if i'm going to apply a formula and I say equal sum, and I maybe say, and you can see there, my range is listed. Do you see what it highlights? It highlights that whole range. So this is how we can define the name of a whole range within Excel.